I'm your host, Michael Yerby. It's another lovely day in Shreveport, Louisiana. We are five hours away from New Orleans, three hours away from Dallas, but I'm just one minute from getting in your butt if you haven't gotten up to start your day. Welcome to the Breakfast Boost. Good morning, Boost. This is your main man, Michael Yerby, hitting your speakers with episode lucky number 13 of the Breakfast Boost. And guess what? Today we're sliding into a topic that's sneakier than a silent DJ at a block party. Yeah, you guessed it. Procrastination. Now, y'all know how it goes. Y'all vibe into your favorite track and suddenly, boom, you remember. That thing we were supposed to do last week. And you're like, nah, I'll spin that track and I'll do it tomorrow. But hey, we've all been there hitting that snooze button to our to-do list. So here's a little dad joke to kick things off. Why do procrastinators get a job at a calendar factory? Because he's always putting off his dates. All right, all right, all right. Enough playing around. Today we're going to break it down. The DJ booth of procrastination. While we hit pause on our tasks and how we remix our routine to keep productivity beats dropped. Whether you're hustling in the city or grinding online, it's time to turn up the volume on your goals and say goodbye to that I'll do it later vibes. So tighten those headphones, grab your morning boost, and let's dive deep into the rhythms and get things done. It's time to turn procrastination into proactive action right here on The Breakfast Boots. Let's get it done. All right, boosters, it's time for that wake up wisdom where we drop some serious knowledge to kickstart your day. Today, we're vibing with a quote from one of our founding fathers, Benjamin Franklin. He said, you may delay, but time will not. Let that marinate for a second. Man, that's pretty deep. See, in the hustle of life, it's easy to say, I'll do it later. But time, time just keeps moving on. Let's make that smooth beat never stop. We're all chasing dreams, right? Trying to make moves, be in the studio, the office, or just life in general. But here's the thing. Procrastination is like that sneaky villain that likes to hit pause on your dreams. Think about it. You're writing lyrics for a track, planning that business move, or maybe you're just trying to get fit. And then you say, nah, I'll start Monday. But why Monday? Franklin says, hey, time's not waiting for you. So why are you waiting on time? It's about grabbing those minutes, hours, and days and making them count. We got to be like a DJ with our time, mixing, blending, and making every second pop. So let's challenge ourselves. Today, let's take one thing we've been putting off and hit play on it. It could be anything, small or big. It doesn't matter. Just start. You'd be surprised how that first step could turn into a whole journey. Remember, boosters, time always on the move. So let's move with it. Make today the day you stop the lane and start playing. And hey, when you do, hit us up on social media. Use the hashtag Breakfast Boost Action and let me know what you're conquering today. Let's inspire each other because that's how we grow together. All right, y'all. That is our wake up wisdom for today. Keep this quote in your pocket and let it remind you, no more waiting. It's time for creating. Up next, we're diving deep into understanding procrastination and how to kick it to the curb. Stay locked in. This is the Breakfast Boost. All right, boosters, it's time to dive deep into the heart of today's episode. We're talking about procrastination today, and it's not just what it is, but how we break free from its grip. So what is procrastination? It's like when you got a track to lay down or a project due and you keep saying, I'll do it later. But it's not just being lazy or not feeling it. It's deeper. Sometimes you're scared of not being perfect or you feel like the task is too big or too tough. It's like standing on the edge of the stage, mic in hand, and not stepping into the spotlight. Now let's break it down. Why we do this? Fear of failure? That's a big one. Nobody wants to feel like they can't cut it. Perfectionism? Another heavy hitter. You want that track, that project to be fire, and anything less feels like a no-go. Or maybe you're just feeling not motivated. That beat's not hitting right, and you can't find your flow. 
But here's the key, boosters. We can flip the script on procrastination. How? First up, break it down. Got a big project? Slice it into manageable pieces. Set deadlines like I'll write one first by the night. Make your workspace height. Clean it up. Set the vibe. Whatever gets you in the zone. And routines. Stay like the beat you groove to every day. Create a routine that's all about moving forward step by step. You don't write a whole album in one night, right? Same with your big goals. Chip away at it day by day. I want you to think about that one thing you've been pushing off. Picture it now. Imagine breaking it down, setting small goals for the day and hitting it. How does it feel? That's the power of stepping into the mic and taking control. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to challenge ourselves. Let's pick one thing that we've been putting off and start it today, not tomorrow, not next week, today. And when you do, share with us. Use the hashtag Breakfast Boost Action on all your social and let's light up the internet with your rules. All right, boosters, that's our deep dive on procrastination. Up next, we got our boost of the day. Stay locked in. This is the Breakfast Boost, where we turn procrastination into action. Let's keep this energy flowing. All right, boosters, it's time for our boost of the day. This is where we drop one golden nugget to supercharge your hustle. And today is all about a simple yet powerful move, the two-minute rule. Here's the deal. If you got something that can be done in two minutes or less, do it right now. Don't sleep on it or put it on the back burner. Whether it's sending a quick email, jotting down a lyric, or just tidying up your space. If it's two-minute task, hit it up immediately. Think about it. Those small wins, they add up. It's like laying down a track after track. And before you know it, you got a whole album. Small steps lead to big ones. And this two-minute rule is your starting beat. So here's the challenge, boosters. For the next week, live by this rule. When you see something that's a quick fix, a fast track, don't delay. Do it straight away. And let's see how those changes the game for you. More done, less stress, and it's a buy for getting things moving. And you know we're all about sharing that positive energy. Hit us up with your experiences using the hashtag Breakfast Boost Action on your favorite socials. Tweet it, snap it, post it, whatever you do. Let the world know how you turn your minutes into momentum. I can't wait to see how this two-minute rule sparks fire in your day. Remember, it's the small steps that lead to giant leaps. So boosters, let's get stepping. Coming up next, we're wrapping this session with some fine thoughts and a sneak peek at our next episode. You're tuned in to the Breakfast Boost, where we turn every moment into a chance to level up. Stay locked in. We're just getting started. All right, boosters, we're winding down this session and what a ride it's been. We've been all about breaking the chains of procrastination, turning later into now. Remember, every big dream starts with one small step. So let's keep stepping one day at a time. Today, we broke down what procrastination really is, looked it in the eye and learned how to dance around it. From understanding the why to master the how, all about turning those setbacks into comebacks. It's not just about doing more. It's about doing it smart. And hey, don't forget our two-minute rule challenge. I'm doing it with you. Together, we're about to make those small wins count. Share your journey with us using the hashtag Breakfast Boost Action. Let's flood the internet with our positive vibes. Next week, we're going to take it up a notch. Tune in for Navigating Change, Tips for Adapting and Thriving. We're going to dive into how to roll with life punches and come out swinging with a style of our own. You don't want to miss it. And before we bounce, Hit us up on our socials. Share your tips, your wins, and your journey. The Breakfast Boost is more than just a podcast. It's a community, and you're a vital part of it. If today's episode hit the spot, spread the love. Share it with your crew, subscribe for more, and let's keep this positive energy flowing. Follow the Breakfast Boost on your social media for your daily dose of inspiration.
All right, boosters, we're at the end of another fly episode of The Breakfast Boost. Big thanks for tuning in and vibing with us on this journey to smash procrastination. Remember, every little step counts. So let's keep pushing, keep striving, and let's turn our do laters into I'm going to do it now. And don't forget to hit us up with your stories and successes using the hashtag Breakfast Boost Action. Your voice matters, and we're all here to cheer each other on. If you dug today's episode, spread the word, share with your friends, subscribe for more fire content, and help us grow this Breakfast Boost family. Follow us on all your favorite social media platforms for that daily inspiration. Next week, we're diving into navigating change, tips for adapting and thriving. You don't want to miss it. Until then, stay positive, stay grinding, and remember, every day is a fresh opportunity to boost your day to the next level. This is Michael Yerby, your host. Until next time, keep shining, keep striving, and remember, your morning sets the stage for your day. Make it count one morning at a time. Catch you on the next wave. Bye, boosters.